Hello, everybody. I am Brian Mullins the Fox here for the first episode of the Brian Mullins the Fox Show. The stream episode length will gradually increase with time and interest. I got a few things to get out of the way initially, some updates before I get to the main topic of this podcast episode, which will be somehow short. Number one, I will only do this podcast show once every other week. So like two or three episodes this month and two or three episodes the next month. And I'll do this until April of next year. And then I'll get back to doing commentaries and rants. And yeah, I'll just consider this season one. And next season will be from early November to early April. So from November 4th to April 4th, or any time between this. And yes, I am recording this audio through Audacity, so if you don't like the quality of this stream, that's okay. I already have the ability to just overdub it with the audio I'm recording right now in Audacity. So... This stream won't be too long. All right, that's those are two updates. Three, I'll try not to overwhelm you with live streams. So, yeah, those are the three updates. I'll just, you know, stream on any given day of the month. It could be a Saturday, it could even be a Sunday, but either which, those are the only two days I'll do one or two episodes every other week. That's update number four. So recap, update number one is I won't be doing this too often. Two to three episodes every other week. Two, it'll be from November 4th to April 4th. Three, I'm recording this audio in Audacity, but you're hearing it through StreamYard, so the quality will be different between the two, obviously. And four, I don't want to overwhelm you, so I'll just not do them anymore between the rest of April all the way up to the end of the next edition of the Roast Game Awareness Month in 2024. That's for next year, but for this year, let's just begin and start this one off. Let's talk about empiricism, and let me go off on a little bit of a rant before I conclude and then go and end this episode. Empiricism matters the most. You can't just use logic. You can't just use reason alone. You can't just use empiricism alone without logic or and or reason. You have to have both to then acquire the ability and facilitate the ability to use all three at once. All right. As you can hopefully see in the edited version of this episode, here's what this graphic said. All right, there are three color banners. The first one to the left is orange, the one in the middle is yellow, and the one to the top right, or a good portion to the top right, is lime green. Let's go to the orange. All right, it says logic only. The basis of thought and theory, and and below it, it says not enough. Let's move into the yellow box and go through reason only. There are six things on this yellow block. Number one, evidence. Number two, logical suggestions. Number three, proof. Number four, statistics. Number five, stronger basis of theory. And six, consistency. But here we go. 
Here we go to the lime green rectangle or block, if you consider it a block still, even though it's rectangular. When you add empiricism to logic and reason, number one, you practice what you preach. Number two, you're able to rule out all other conclusions objectively, honestly, and without any doubt that you'd be wrong in the long run. And number three, you'd get closest to or you reach and approach the truth itself. And below it is this black box that says the following in white text. Number one, you can't just use logic to back up your claim. Anything that stands to reason is also necessary. Number two, you can't just use reason alone. You also have to use logic for basis as well. I'm adding to it a bit. And finally, number three, empiricism is when you never have to go against the very value statements and even factual observations you preach, you've proven to be true, and you've shared to the public. And in red text, it says, that's how atheism isn't a religion. Because it's not. And it doesn't have to be. It really doesn't. Enough said. So, I'm just going to go off on a short rant real quick. I'm going to say this. The logic only phase for the topic of the roast game was between October 20th, 2017, which was over six years ago, up until September 28th, 2018, over five years ago. The day I've done basically roughly 24 hours of research, even processing it in my sleep uh, before I posted the calorie video, the infamous one that got all the ruffle that uh, uh, that got all the feathers ruffled. The second phase is the reason only phase is between the end of the logic only phase. To December 31st, 2021. And then the empiricism stage where I actually practiced what I preached as fact with evidence proven, everything else, logical suggestions, statistics, stronger basis of theory and consistency to go with it. And the law of non-contradiction. That's from New Year's Day 2022 to present. And I'm fucking glad I got this done. And I'm fucking glad I'm here with you. And this is the first episode of the podcast. And hopefully you're hearing me through the phone. And I will inevitably download this stream. And then chop it up to bits and add some images and some background music. uh, And upload it to my second channel. All right, so I don't need to rant as much because I've posted that rant that was exclusive to my Rant Archive channel. Just a rant here. I'm glad I got this fucking done. I don't need to go through any further stages of objectivity because I've reached the top and I'm well above the top at this point. So thank you for watching this podcast episode it will be over as soon as i get through recapping empiricism is most important when you're accompanying it with logic and reason that's number one number two is i've given you all the recaps and updates i possibly can even from earlier when the stream started And number three, I am Brian Mullins the Fox signing out. See you in the next episode of the Brian Mullins the Fox Show. The next week. After next week.
Bye.